Hello everybody, welcome back. Today is Sunday, April 7th, which means that it is Mr. Aries and Nimbus's second birthday. So today we're just going to be celebrating their birthday with them. Right here you can see two very sad faces because right in front of me I have their special birthday salads, which they are absolutely excited about since they heard me chopping veggies in the kitchen and can obviously smell them now. So they're anxiously awaiting to get their birthday prezi. Treat, treat? Do you want a treat? So yes, they're all super excited. So I guess I'll go ahead and give the salad to the birthday boys first since they are the guests of honor. And this is just a salad with all of their favorite things. It has romaine lettuce, cucumber, carrots, and a bit of cilantro as well. So I hope they enjoy it since this is pretty much what they absolutely love from all the vegetables I give them. So here it is. Nimbus, treat, treat. Treat, treat. Come get your treat. It's right here, honey. It's right here. Come on, go get it. He's blocking the way. There we go. Okay, so the birthday boys got their salad. Let's go next with Mr. Barbok. Do you want a treat? Do you want a treat? Yeah. Come here. I'll put it here in the middle of the cage so we can actually see you. And Mr. Shinobi. This bowl right here. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about you. Here. Treat, treat. Treat, treat. Go get it. There you go. And of course, we can't forget about Foster Piggy. Now, Caleb's salad is a little bit different since he doesn't like cucumber. I always find them in his cage, so he just has romaine lettuce, cilantro, and a bit of carrot as well. So, all right, Caleb. Treat, treat. He's starting to pick up on the treat as well. As soon as the other pigs start weaking, he starts weaking as well when he hears the magic word. Oh, is that yummy? He always runs away with his salad. So this is what my piggies do with their salads. I give it to them and they just take a piece and run off with it into their houses. I can never actually film them eating it from the bowl. Some of them do stay out, like Mr. Nimbus here, who's just showing his bum. But anyway, today is Aries and Nimbus' second birthday. I adopted them in May of last year. They were a little bit over a year old. And I was told that Aries' birthday is today, April 7th. But for Nimbus, we don't actually know what his actual age is. They told me that he should be about a year old at that time that I adopted him. So I just decided to make their birthday the same day so I can celebrate them together and I don't know if he's older or younger than Aries, but I think they should be pretty much about the same age since their activity level is pretty much the same, so he really can't be that that much older or younger than Aries. There we go, we finally got him to turn around. <laughs> so this is actually going to be their birthday present this time. I didn't get them any actual presents because they still have lots and lots of toys and stuff from Christmas, which will last them a long time, so I really don't need anything else for them right now, but I don't think there's anything that better than veggies as a birthday present for them because they absolutely love it, as Mr. Nimbus is enjoying. Huh? You like your treats? I can't see his face. Here's a piggy that's out and about, so we can show a different pig for a little bit. Here's Mr. Barbok numbing on his veggies. He was in his hut, but he finally decided to come out to say hi, so everybody could see him. And besides Aries and Nimbus's birthday, I guess there's not much else really to talk about. No news is good news, I guess. Everybody has been doing well, and everything has been pretty much the same. And some people have asked me to show my cages. I don't really like showing my cages that much because I don't change them very often, but I guess I can just go ahead and do a little whirlwind tour. So here is Mr. Shinobi's cage. It's pretty much the same. The only thing that I've changed with these top cages is that I moved the water bottle and the hay to the same section. I used to have the water bottle here and the hay here, and I just found that the kitchen area took a lot of space in the cage, so I decided to try it this way, and it's been working pretty well. And the same with this cage as well. I just switched the water bottle to next to the hay rack over here and put the house over here so just pretty much looks the same as Shinobi's cage. You want to say hi? Piggy. No, he doesn't want to. So that's the top cages for you. 
not much has changed. Everything is actually the same. And in the bottom cage, the same as well. These guys absolutely demolished their veggies and Nimbus is now back eating his hay. So yes, this cage is absolutely the same. Not much going on. Same stuff, the only things that I change around are the fleece and the toys and that kind of thing. Are you done? Are you gonna eat the bowl now? <laughs> oh, there's a little piece there that he had to get. It's right under you. Did you miss it? Go get it! There we go. I guess he was looking for something that wasn't cilantro, maybe. I think he has a carrot or something. And here's Mr. Caleb's cage. Same as well, the water bottle, the hay rack, the little potty pad, some wooden toys, willow toys, the hut, and the little cozy sack in the corner. And he demolished his veggies as well. Well, he's still eating some in there, but I don't think he'll come out for us right now. Caleb! Piggy! And here he is. I think he came out looking for more veggies. Are they all gone? So yeah, he's been doing really well here. And he's actually gotten a little bit better with the um, biting habit that he has. And he's also been getting a little bit chunkier. Yeah, you've been well fed? You've been well fed? <laughs> Hi, cutie. Yeah. So there's Mr. Caleb. He's a very happy pig. Yeah. Sorry, there's no more. <laughs> Are you going to be running around? I'm going to eat his hay. He eats tons of hay. Of my piggies, Aries and Nimbus are the ones that eat the most hay, but he pounds through quite a lot of hay as well. He absolutely loves it. Huh? Yeah. Oh, you're so cute. And here's just a little whirlwind tour of Teasel's cage. Looks pretty much the same as well. The only thing that I changed are cute little decorations in her cage. If we zoom in a little bit. You can see that those are little Easter eggs with little bunny ears on them and I thought they were adorable. So I decided to get a few for her cage. Here's a white one and here's another white one. I thought they were absolutely adorable and had to put them in her cage. I didn't put them in the piggies cage because they're plastic and I know that they would chew all of them up and plastic isn't really very ideal for chewing. I'd rather ha let the piggies have wooden chews and willow sticks and that kind of thing for chewing. Teasel! And I actually heard little Miss Teasel rustling in here. So you may get a little bit of an unappearance. And there she is. She was awake. She was just pretending to be asleep. Huh, honey? She still doesn't want to be bothered. There we go. Hi, Teasel. You gonna come out for us? Probably not. Nope, she's just going to dig further in there, so I'll just go ahead and leave her alone then, since she does want to sleep. Hi! Hello! Yeah, I'll just leave her alone. Let me put this back on here. Oh, Teasel. Now back to the piggies. Somebody's still trying to make a dent on his veggies. They probably were full of hay since I did refill their hay racks recently and didn't have much space left for the veggies. Huh? Oh, shinny. And I think Mr. Barbuck hasn't finished his veggies either. Nope. They're still there and he's just numbing on hay. What's wrong with the veggies? Are you full? <laughs> and it seems like the birthday boys have pounded their salad. It is absolutely gone. There is no trace of the salad and Mr. Nimbus is in a food coma in his little hut. He's moving very slowly. I think he may have eaten too much. And Mr. Aries apparently still had some space left in his tummy because he's numbing on some hay. Well, I guess that's it for now, guys. I don't know what else to talk about, really. I just wanted to wish Mr. Aries and Nimbus a happy birthday, give them their birthday salad and just show all of the piggies to you guys for a little bit. I hope that you enjoyed seeing the piggies running around and eating their veggies. 
I guess I'll catch you next time in my next video, and thank you so much for watching. Bye!